know, the most common types of systems that we're going to see. Um, I would say probably about 80% of the systems we see are going to be in the conventional variety where we've got tank, drains into a header, header diverts that water into, into the system, and it drains through the stone, cleans the water, and goes back into the ground. That's going to be by far the most common uh, system that we see. Um, your uh, engineered systems are going to be probably another, you know, if there's 80% conventional, we're probably seeing 15 to 17% uh, engineered systems where we've got a pump chamber and um, for a variety of, of reasons, the, the drain field's got to be elevated above the, the septic tanks, um, so it's got to be pumped up and it could be just flowing out and spreading out in the drain field. It could be pressurized where we get that real, uh, real good uh, distribution of, of water through the system. And then, you know, three, four, five percent of the systems that we see are going to have that uh, pre-treatment um, alternative type of system where we've got filters, could be a sand filter, could be a, uh, a different type of media filter. Um, with that aeration and uh, uh, control of how much water is being allowed to um, exit to the to the drain field, uh, where you're going to see that system in installed is, is typically where there's there's a less optimal uh, type of soil in the ground for drainage.